Hi, this topic is fairly extensive. It's a very important topic, and I'm not going to sort them in any kind of priority because I think all of these are important. So this is the 10 signs that your partner doesn't love you, even if you think they do. But why are you searching this if you are sure that they do? I'm Paul Friedman. I founded the Marriage Foundation. Now is a good time to subscribe. It really helps our channel. We've got I, I 56,000 subscribers already. We're doing very well. And we would like you to subscribe too. So I would say the number one that I'm going to choose is that your partner is not paying as much attention to you unless you are paying attention to them. So when you were first together, think back. They were always wondering how you were doing. They were always paying attention to you to see if you were paying attention to them, to see if you needed something. And that is a manifestation of love. This kind of attentiveness is a manifestation of love. And that's what we want in our marriage. We want to feel loved and we want to love them too. Now, you have to ask yourself, what about you? Are you paying attention to them only because you need something? Or are you always interested in how they are doing? Are you only paying attention when you think maybe they have straying eyes? Or they are spending too much time on social media and not enough time on you? Are you coming from a place of selflessness where you care about them? Or are you only paying attention to them when you want to be sure that they're still connected to you? So that's number one. Number two, your partner doesn't spontaneously say, I love you. Now, this may not be true in your case because there are some people who don't express their love in words. And that's okay. But before you got married even, you were expressing your love to each other in different ways. And those ways should still be there. And if they're not, that's a sign. Now I'm going to ask you a question because we've already decided that you are not 100% sure. Why not? Shouldn't you be? Shouldn't you be 100% sure that your partner still loves you? How do you know? And we're going to bring these points out, but you yourself should be determining whether you still love them or whether you're just expecting them to love you. Number three, number three is that your partner is spending way too much time doing other things. Because if that's the case, if they're not just there for you all the time, that's sending you a message, isn't it? And again, you need to be very careful about how you are with them. It's so easy to start taking our partner for granted. That's the number one killer in marriages, by the way. I call it over familiarity. Now you have come to the Marriage Foundation's YouTube channel where I give these videos and I want you to join us all the time. But I also want you to look at our website. See what's there. See what we have to offer you. We want your marriage to be phenomenal. Again, I'm Paul Friedman. I founded the Marriage Foundation. Like the video, leave a comment if you wish. Get in touch with us. And God bless you and take care. And stand by for part two.